I think we're okay go. now. Oh. <laughs> yeah, microphone wire just totally ripped in half. Completely ripped in half. Like, uh -oh. literally like two <laughs> seconds before I'm supposed to start talking. Like, got nothing. <laughs> Thank it's you fixed. for that, my friend. Yes, we are fixed. <laughs> I've got sports mic now. Okay, so let's go out to Plymouth meeting here. It is clear as a bell off in the distance. No problems seeing that Center City skyline here in the distance. Radio towers in the distance as well. And yeah, I mean, your visibility is totally fine, but this is still, even at face value, it looks fine, right? But this is still a day that's going to have very substantial impacts on your travel. Sun glare is eventually one of those problems, but then also those gusts. So some of the most updated w peak wind gusts that we've had. Yep, we had a 60 mile per hour gust at Beach Haven. Len Hartsville picked up just shy of that further inland. Furlong, Philly, Morristown, all into the 50s with peak wind gusts so far. And eventually this is going to ease up, but not really anytime soon. We've got a high wind warning right through 6 p.m. So just shy of 12 hours in addition that uh, we've already been dealing with the wind and we currently have wind speeds that are very, very noticeable well into the 20s across most of the region. These are your sustained winds. Then you've got to factor in the gusts on top of all of that. So here's a look at storm scan three where there's not necessarily an organized system rolling through, but you've got lake enhanced snow showers rolling through here and some of them have made it as far south as I 80 northern portion of that northeast extension. So that would be the reason that you're finding a few flakes. If you see them that far north, rest of us are just in the sunshine and it is a beautiful looking day, but it's pretty harsh outside when you factor in those winds into the 30s come Tuesday and Wednesday at best. So it's a chillier than average forecast for the next couple of days. Guys.